Hey, Shalom Makim. I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, and Kadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone who do well. Peace, blessings, and salutations to you, sister. I came out there pushing the truth across the four corners of earth. All right, I'm the brother Shimon of Great Millstone, Chicago. Uh, real quick, just quick spiritual thoughts, man, because we're coming up to, you know, the holiday season, man. This is the time of year where people are prone to making emotional decisions, you know, for what they feel like is for their family or, you know, whatever their uh, warped logic is. And uh, we know that uh, Biden is, you know, coming out with these different statements about receiving the Maxine Waters. Damn, some, some big ass rats out here. But uh, Salaki, <laughs> we know Biden is coming down with these statements, man, about receiving the Maxine Waters. And we know that uh, that, that stuff is leaving people in a, a stupefied state, all right? And uh, it's, it's setting people up, you know. To, to be in a, a weakened mental, you know, physical state so that they'll receive that karagma when the time comes. Right, which, you know, a lot of these people, it is what it is. They're going to take it right, and they're going to be destroyed. Right, but the, this is James 5 and 14. It says, but not all things, my brother, swear not. But above all things, so like you swear not. Right, neither by heaven, neither by the earth, neither by any oath. But let your yea be yea, and your nay nay, lest ye fall into condemnation. All right, and it's very important, man, you know, to, to know, basically, to have it in your mind and know and understand if that time does come, you know, for, for when they come and they ask and they propose or, you know, they try to, you know, pull the, the, the old uh, one-two, you know, razzle-dazzle, you know, maybe with your kids or your family or whoever that you know, it's, it's, a, it's a nay, all right? It's, it is what it is, man. It's a nay. It's a no, all right? My, your yay is your yay. Your yay, nay is your nay. All right, look, scriptures talk about counting the cost. You know, brothers know what they signed up for. You know, you know what I'm saying? What, what the elect is going to do, the elect is going to say. The scriptures tells you that. Shit. Tell them no, all right? And... There's so many precepts for accounts in the scriptures where, you know, things were low or it was times of war or times of poverty and the Lord made a way for our people, okay? Even going through the wilderness, it says he preserved their shoes, all right, going through the wilderness. And the Lord sent people manna out of heaven, all right? Hey, Lord, man, so many things the Lord could do. All right, so much spiritual power has been displayed. Well, the Lord could do it even without spiritual power. He could have it. He could grant you favor, you know, with with somebody, you know, maybe a non-believer, a heathen, or whoever. The Lord could grant you favor, and then that person to help you out. All right, however the Lord wants to do it, man, because we all have different stories, different situations, but we all want, you know, to be a part of the elect. All right, this is for the, 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 these videos we do is for the hopeful elect. All right, but uh, it says what? Is there any among you afflicted? Let him pray. Is any merry? Let him sing psalms. All right. Any if is any sick among you? Let him call for the elders of the church, and let them pray over him, anointing him with oil in the name of the Lord. All right. So. You feeling low, you feeling sick, take some of that oil and be anointed with it. All right, then the elders are also going to tell you, you know, about your diet, you know. And uh, scriptures tell you, man, that, that, you know, with the herbs and all of that, you know, you could, you could take the herbs, but ultimately it's the Lord that blesses you. It's the Lord that heals you. All right, but he does, you know, his, he does, uh, he did give us her the herbs, you know, for use. All right. So, at the end of the day, man, you're gonna trust the creation of the Lord. All right. You gonna have faith in Him, and that 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 anointing on those herbs are gonna bless you. All right. Or a combination of both. All right. And that's that's just what it is, man. These people they don't have faith. That's why when they come out with this stuff, and they'll they'll tell you 
Like they'll they'll they they actually they have already told on themselves, but they'll tell you it takes years to develop certain de- medical devices uh, created for insertion. They they'll tell you, you know that, but then they'll also tell you, oh yeah, you know this has been developed fast. And oh, wait a minute, All right, But then now they're talking about uh, you know postal workers. You know they're not required to take it. All right, which when I uh, when, when I asked one of them about it, they basically were saying that uh, Biden wants to keep, you know, uh, um, he wants to keep black Democrats, uh, you know, the black Democrats and the, you know, black middle class, you know, he wanted to keep them happy so he didn't require the United States Postal Service to um, uh, uh, receive that, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm talking about. Uh, and then the you know the Latinos and Native Americans as well, I guess they're mingled in there too. But you know it's a lot of a lot of uh, Southern Kingdom who works for the Postal Service because um, basically they promised back in the '60s that they wouldn't discriminate, and that was the you know cat the benefits, the packages, you know whatever. All right, we all know we all got that older person in our family who work work for the post office. All right, but. The point being, you know, it's, it's just so many um, little, uh, uh, you know, weird um, and, 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 and non-logical, you know, as the scriptures talk about unrighteous decrees, man. Hey, let your yay be yay and your nay be nay. All right? This ain't going to be long, man. This is Second Thessalonians uh, 2 and 1. It says, Now we beseech you, brethren, by the coming of our Lord Yahweh Shai HaMashiach, and by our gathering together unto him, that ye be not soon shaken in mind, or be troubled, neither by spirit, nor by word, nor by letter, as from us, as that day of Yahweh Shai is at hand. Alright, so no matter what happens, man, let us not be shaken in mind or troubled. Alright, the Lord has us. The Lord has us, man. The Lord has us. He didn't wake us up for us to, you know, destroy us. And right, now you got a certain, you know, certain men, you know what I'm saying, they were wake, waking up, you know, to, to be used as, ser- you know, services of the Lord. And then, you know, they go into their wickedness and then they go back into the world and they're going to be destroyed. All right. But, you know, this is the hopeful elect, you know, continuing on in the things that we've learned. You know, continuing, you know, to, to follow the, uh, the acceptable service of the Lord. You know, saying, look, we're looking forward to salvation. All right, we gotta have hope. We gotta have faith and hope. All right, as, that that if, as we maintain, you know, again the things that we've learned, man, because you have a lot of Jakes too, who they'll start off, you know, on the right path, and we, you know, we don't have to say their name. You know who they are. Started off on the right path, but you know, they swerved out of lane, and, you know, now they're in danger of hellfire, All right? It says, yeah, let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come, except there come a falling away first. All right, and there was a falling away. We fell away. We fell away from who we are. We fell away from the law, statutes, commandments, you know, all, right? all the tribes we fell away, all right? Even if some of us, you know, may have had a... Uh, a, a, a zeal of righteousness or had, you know, some, you know, small parts. It, hey, they could have, some of us could have had the name. But as a people, as a nation, we fell away. Hey, that's the point. It said, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. And shit, he's being revealed. He's revealed. All right, we can see who he is. We can see what he does. Shit, the jig is up. Even his own people know that he's full of shit. Uh, that's why there's going to be so much chaos and turmoil. Right? People, you know, shit, people going to fight back. Everybody's not going to just lay down. And that's when, you know, the, the second edge is 15. That's when a lot of that stuff is going to take place. All right, it says what? Remember, yeah. It says, who, who, verse 4, Salaki, who opposeth and exalted himself above all that is called the Most High, and that, or that is worshipped, 
so that he as the Most High sitteth in the temple of the Most High, showing himself that he is the Most High. All right, and that's basically what Esau Edom has done, man. He's exalted himself and made himself, you know, all of the heroes are him. All of the ancient wise kings are, is him. All of the strongest warriors and the, you know, most brilliant minds in history. And, you know, everybody honorable is him. All right. Shit, the most high is him. It looks like him. The sun, it looks like him. The prophets, the angels. Eh, yeah, looks like him, you know. The devil, eh, you know, the devil, the devil's black. You know, they'll throw all this uh, this madness and confusion in there, but, you know, <laughs> we know that all of the heavenly bodies, okay, which were created of the Father, are so-called dark-skinned men, all right? We know, hey, the, the true form of, of the uh, left-handed spirits, Right, because of course we know they can they can appear as a uh, other shit as well, but the true form of the left hand is spirits, right? So called dark skinned men. It, it says what? Remember ye not? And that's exactly who our people worship, man. They worship the they, they worship Esau, Edom. That's why they're gonna be willing to do all of this stuff, go down this path. Now, if everybody just said no, you know, fuck you, no. We're not with it, all right? Then they would have to change the plan, you know what I'm saying? They would have to, you know, try to do something else, all right? But, you know, people are going to give, people are going to crack, you know, people are giving into uh, the demons of capitalism, man. Everybody wants to capitalize off the next person, and that's why everybody's going to lose, all right? Because everybody's willing to give, everybody's willing to, sell out, you know what I'm saying, for a certain price, and that's why everybody's going to lose, all right, and that's why this place is going to go down, <laughs> the scriptures say they're going to be casting their gold and silver into the streets, all right, all of that shit is going to mean nothing, it says, remember ye not that when I was yet with you, I told you all these things, and now ye know that withholdeth that he might be revealed in his time, all right, for the mystery of iniquity doth already work, only he who now letteth will let until he be taken out of the way. And then shall the wicked be revealed, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth, and he shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. Right, and we know exactly what's going to happen when the, when the brightness of the coming, when, when the Lord comes and the brightness of his coming is shown forth across the earth. All right, and this is why they're going up into the heavens and, you know, creating all these space stations, they even sending civilians up. It's no longer for military and and other uses too. They're sending civilians up, scientists up as well. All right, how can we stop this? How can we, you know, protect you know, all that we've uh, created? All right, which this is exactly uh, what 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 they're allowing right here. What is this? An offering to Poseidon. The Greeks are praying for a safe return home. I hope the sea god spits in their offering. Let's them all drown at the bottom of the sea. This is a gift. We should take it to the temple of Poseidon. I think we should burn it. Burn it, my prince. It's a gift to the gods. Father, burn it. Gift to the gods. So bring it in. All right. Great movie. You gotta you definitely gotta check it out. But you know, that's that's basically what our people have taken, you know, all of this science and all of this information. That's what they've taken it as, man. See, this this man is a god. You know, just because he's exalted himself as God, just because he's uh did all this stuff, but he also lied, he also put you in the captivity. And did all of this wickedness to achieve all of this stuff, right? This, hey, how do you think that they test these uh, medical insertion apparatuses, all right? Through rats, all right? And there have to be some sort of human trials to them, right? To see what adverse effects may happen, all right? So, hey, man, 
continue to, to stay up, man. Let your yay be yay, nay be nay. I'm going to continue to pray for strength in the times to come. Shalom.